Hello, you're watching the Star News Update. I'm Alicia Lim. Datuk Sri Najib Tun Razak says the key performance index for the public sector should include indicators that relate to public satisfaction. Yang boleh kita perbaiki di masa ke semasa Menentukan bahawa latihan dan pembangunan kerja yang dapat dilakukan secara tersusun Menjaga perasaan hati supaya pengarahan kerja itu disampaikan dengan cara yang bersopan Najib says that as government administrative officers and public servants went about their daily routines, they at times forgot that one of the key factors in the analysis of the performance was the level of public satisfaction. He said this while addressing the staff of the Prime Minister's department during their monthly gathering on Monday. Unemployed graduates and retrenched workers can now learn how to start a franchise business. Task Force Chief Coordinator Dr. Jeffrey Goh says it is more viable to start a franchise business as they are based on proven management and delivery systems compared to the facing of greater risks starting a conventional business from scratch. But where else are studies that show that if uh, entrepreneurship through franchising, meaning when you buy a franchise, the success rate is between 70 to 80 percent, meaning out of 10 businesses through franchising, the studies that show that 7 to 8 will, will, will succeed. This is why the uh, National MCA Youth has picked uh, to spearhead uh, by doing this uh, seminar that is uh, entrepreneurship through franchising. And he told reporters this during a press conference on Monday. The seminar will be jointly organized by the MCA Youth Economic Task Force and franchising consultancy Asia White Franchise and will be held at Wisma MCA's auditorium on May 19. Pera Assembly Speaker V. Sivakumar has applied to the Sultan of Pera for a postponement of Thursday's Assembly sitting. In his blog posting on Monday, Sivakumar said that his application to Sultan Azlan Shah was in view that the Pera Menteri Besar's position was still being considered by the Kuala Lumpur High Court. He says that it is not acceptable to have the sitting when the Menteri Besar's position is still being questioned in court. For updates, log on to thestaronline.tv. I'm Alicia Lim. Thanks for watching.